A little bit of Rhinox Hide and a torn piece of sponge can do wonders to create some random damage on the armor. I wanted to mostly skip the edge highlighting step on these models, but still wanted to have some brighter spots on the armor. Adding a little bit of Andresian Grey under the Rhinox Hide spots does exactly that, plus it makes the damage more three-dimensional and real looking. I even added a couple of spots of Lead Belcher inside the biggest Rhinox Hide spots to make the damage look even deeper. Since I was already at it, I added a couple of token edge highlights and scratches here and there, 